coach to you are you open to management committee members and FA officials suggesting to you i'm not saying interfering and i'm choosing my words carefully suggesting to you players to use collapse and even match day selections are you open to that conversation or you are the type that insists that you are the coach and your decisions are final are you open to discussing your teams and selections with officials of the FA? Thank you very much. Naravno da da ću razgovarati sa sa svima, sa komitetom da i menadžmentom. Of course, it's important to have good communication with the management of the GFA, and I'm always ready to talk about everything. Uh, of course, uh, about the players, and uh, uh, I'm open to hear ideas. This is how I work. But at the end, when it comes to the decision who will be uh, invited for the team, this is my decision because it's my job and I'm responsible. So at the end, uh, about the collapse, the decision is mine. Uh, welcome back, Milu. Thank, Thank you for the memories. Looking through your profile, a lot of the golden moments, your playing I mean, career and managerial career, a lot of the golden moment has got to do with Ghana. Uh, very little, even after you left. Uh, would you be glad to point out some of the challenges, I mean, you've encountered, making you basically unsuccessful, even at um, club sites um, since you left? Yeah. And we understand that you've been here, like President confirmed, since Sunday even before the government approved your appointment. Uh, were you that desperate to come to the country and finish your agenda like you said? You had an unfinished business with Ghana. Were you desperate, even when you were working with other countries, to come back to Ghana? Uh, thank you. Uh, it's very difficult to compare, you know, if you can say unsuccessful or not, but, you know, it's very difficult to compare this success with anything else. It's hard for many coaches to achieve this. So I wouldn't say it's unsuccessful, you know. These are, uh, whenever I worked, I produced some results, and uh, it's for the other people to judge, you know. It's very difficult to say from this position that you are in. Uh, there were many improvements and many 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 things but uh, it would be unfair to say about the obstacles that you can uh, come across very often in this kind of job so um, I'm proud of this success and I was not desperate you know but I was happy to get this chance because I feel this uh, country is like my second home you know because I had a great experience here and uh, as I said before, qualifying for the World Cup is the, and being there is great. So when you get a chance like that, especially to work with the people you know and the uh, mentality that you understand. And I know how much Ghanaians love football, how much they are passionate. This is something that you cannot see at many other places I went to. So. Uh, this is something that everybody would like to repeat in my shoes, you know. So something that was really great and uh, the opportunity to achieve something like that and even go further is something that is a challenge for everybody. And as I said before, I'm up to the task and I'm ready for the challenge. I'm motivated and, and happy to give my best. Thank you.